Hi you guys, so I'm going to be doing a little video for you guys. I'm just gonna show you my makeup routine, like my everyday makeup routine. I hope I have everything in my bag because I would be so mad at myself if I don't have everything in my bag. Anyways, look at my beauty as beauty blender. Actually, I just bought one and this is it. So what I usually do is I moisturize my face first, but there it is, it's right here. Never mind, not not a butt. Okay. So first I moisturize my face with this. It is pharmacy. I bought it at Sephora. I don't remember how much I bought. It was expensive as fuck though. So if you can't afford expensive, I wouldn't even try looking for it to be honest. It might have been like $40. I don't know. I don't remember. So a little goes a long way. As you can see, I've used a lot so far, but I got this last year. So so I only this is what I do. Just wipe it on my face. Look at this. A lot goes a long way. I have a big ass head, okay? So if you can fit on my head, on my face, I mean, it can fit on yours. Two. Mm. <laughs> okay. Now. I use my, I just got this, so I barely even know how to use it correctly, so don't listen to me if you understand that I'm doing it wrong. So it is a Too Faced Hangover 3-in-1, the lighting is horrible, you can't even see it. 3-in-1, it is a 3-in-1 um, prime setting and refresh. So you can put it on and then do this and then put it on again. So I don't do that though, I just spray it and whatever. Because it makes my ma makeup look weird when I spray it, so. And it smells like um, coconut oil, so if you don't like that, then th this is not for you. Okay. I got it in my mouth. Okay. It's like I can taste it, but, you know, whatever. <laughs> All right. So now I'm going to use my beauty blender to put on, this is my foundation. I don't know what shade it is. I don't know how to tell you what shade it is. I'm not the beauty guru here. So this is what I use. That's the thing I use. This shit was also expensive. This was my this is my very first foundation that I ever bought in my life. And I did not realize it was gonna be that expensive. And yes, I've only been doing my makeup since November. Sorry, I can barely talk on camera, it's weird. So I think I'm running out because it's like not squeezing well and I hope I'm not running out because this stuff is expensive. I can't afford another one of these bitches. Look, I'm out. I am literally out of fucking foundation. No, this is not the day I want to be out. Guess how I'm only going to be wrong with this. See if I can do this and not use all of it on like one side. Let's see. We're gonna be diligent. I have um a mirror right here, so I'm gonna see if I can get this all over my face. I can't believe I'm out of makeup. Oh my god, I'm so mad. Just as I said that I was running out, it rained out to me today. I swear to God, there better be more in there. I don't have the money right now to do this, so we're gonna open it up and see. What it looks like on the inside. <laughs> I'm being cheap as fuck, but I ain't trying to waste this stuff. Gonna use the book. There we go. I'm trying to get all of it on my face. So I guess I gotta buy more tomorrow. I'm off work tomorrow, but I've only got like a hundred and something bucks on me. Shit, it's expensive, motherfucker. Anyways, I got all on. At least my face has been really oily. I don't know why. My face is usually really dry. Maybe it's because I'm moisturizing now. I don't know. Now, onto my eyebrows. So. I do not use a pencil because a pencil sucks. It shows up on my skin, but it don't show up on my eyebrows. Really? <laughs> so what I do is, yeah, I'm going to have this right here so I can see what I'm doing at the same time. So I go like this. 
first. Let me brush it out. And then that's when I kind of shape it, like, when I do that. Because I already have eyebrows, like, <laughs> that's no problem at all. Because I don't want my eyebrows to look weird. Like, they, they look weird right now. Like, they don't match at all. Like, it makes me so mad. See, this one looks weird. Like, we're gonna, we're gonna fix this one. There you go. Now they kind of match. They're so lopsided as hell. I don't know why. Anyways, I got this old ass eyebrow thing. It's so old. Look at it. All the stuff is coming off on it. And this thing comes out a lot, so I have to be careful. So what I do is like I mark right here and then I go in, but I only use a little bit. Like you'll see. Then I go back in with the eyebrow thing, eyebrow brush, and I like blend it in. There you go. And then I use it on this side too. I don't know. Why am I putting this back in? Anyway. I'm supposed to be going to a fundraiser at my church. But I need, um, why is my eyebrow? Wait, wait, there you go. I did not just mess that up again. Oh, there you go. <laughs> now, um, concealer to shape my eyebrows. Because it goes. It looks so better when you shape it. So what I do is, I'm gonna show y'all on camera. Hopefully I don't fuck up on camera. There you go. See, I shape it like that. That's all on the bottom too. Cause I like it on the bottom, but I don't use as much on the bottom as I do on the top. Cause it's gonna be really obvious. So, let me get my brush out that I use. I use like a, I don't know what kind of brush it is, honestly. These are my brushes that I use. I use, I used to use this brush, you can tell, but I don't use it anymore. If I can find my other brush, there it is. I have to put super glue on this one because it broke. But I use this brush because it blends out kind of good. What the? See, this thing sucks because. I use it kind of harsh. It keeps coming off and I don't get why. Like brush, stay. See, I like to blend it out like that. Different changer. Okay, now the other one. Oops, I don't want to use all of that. I put too much on the bottom, but it's okay. I can fix that. I can fix that. I think. Like I said, we're gonna use the one I used to use for this one because I kind of fucked it up a little bit.
Is that alright to y'all? I don't think I blended this all the way, but you go got have time to be blending all the extra stuff. Okay, so now I do the underneath my eyes. I do it in triangle form because that's the only way I saw it, people doing it. Oh, I just poked myself. And I have like liquid concealer kind of, so I wait for it to dry a little bit. It doesn't do very much, but whatever, whatever. So I do this a little bit, dry it up, just just a little bit. Don't dry it all the way, it's gonna look like Boo Boo the Clown. So we go do this. I always go with my fingers first. I'm not flicking it all off. I always put my fingers first, and then I use a mini blender so that's not sharp, hard edges, harsh edges. Sorry. I still have sleep in my eye. Girl. I gotta fix that. Yeah. So now, because you can see where it's at, right? So now, I use my beauty blender. Now, you can't even tell. I'll put it on. And now, with the other eye. So this is probably maybe my, I'm going to say my 10th, 10th or 11th time doing makeup, <laughs> like a full face. Like I used to just put foundation on and like eyeliner, but now I like to do full faces. Now I don't bake my face because I don't got all them, them powders yet and I don't really understand baking yet. So I don't do it, but I consider it what I'm about to show you for face. Now I'm going to, um. Uh, Put primer on my eyes. So I use the Master Prime. Oh, I forgot to show you what concealer I use. I'm so bad at this. Okay, I use this kind of concealer. The Pro Concealer from LA Go. In the shade... What, what shade is this? Fawn. I use Fawn. And then I use the Master Prime Matte. I be believe it's a matte, long-lasting eyeshadow base. Yes, it is a prime plus matte base in matte. So, yeah. I still haven't gotten the like the feeling of how much I'm supposed to put on my eyes, but y'all know. I'm new at this, so I'm sorry if this is cringy or if I'm doing it wrong. But I'm new. Y'all gotta start somewhere, right? So I use a finger I haven't used to spread out yet because, oh shit. See, this is why I can't do this when I'm looking at y'all. Because last time I tried using the finger I did the concealer look and it looked weird. Really weird. So I now know I have to like actually like, like blend it. <laughs> because all of um you can see the eyeshadow. You can see this through my eyeshadow if I don't blend it. So, yeah, hold on. I have hooded eyes, so I do my makeup differently than like the average person. Just a FYI to anyone. I can do a tutorial on how to do eyeshadow on hooded eyeballs. And I gotta find, um, the fuck did I put on the brush at? Oh no. Girl, I lost my other my eyeshadow brush. What the fuck? Nigga, how am I supposed to put No I didn't. I lied. It's right here. I lied. <laughs> so we're gonna use my Jolie New York eyeshadow kit. So I have this. I got half off because the little thing in here broke. And they had to like not resell it as full price. Like, see, this is supposed to be attached. 
So I'm going to show you these, these colors right here. And then we got, see, it was supposed to be attached on the other side. You see, really, you see how the, this one is, this one's attached. It was supposed to be attached like that. So this is what it looks like, y'all. Now, I'm not going to use a dark, I haven't used the light shades because well, I'm black and lighter colors make me look ashy. So, amazing. so right now, we're going to go put dark. And since I'm wearing all green, bluish colors, we're going to use greenish, bluish colors. So, let me see what green colors I should use. Okay, so I'm going to try to do ombre again. Let's see how much that works. So I'm gonna use, I'm gonna use this color right here. I think, no, no, no. We're gonna use this color right here. And we're gonna use this color right here. And then we're gonna use black in my 24K new thing. You can see how much I use that thing, damn. But yes, that's what we're going to do. So, let me get the color that I was supposed to do. Oh, shit. Which color was I supposed to do? I know this one. And this one first. Okay. I need to clean my brush again. I blow it so there's no, like, fallout. But there's always fallout. So. Oh, shit. I'm not going to do this in the camera because I know I'm going to mess up, so. So I put it all over the eyelid. Also, I put it up a little bit. So there's no sharp lines when I do the rest of this. Oh my god, I already have all out. Mm. See what that. I always do that so that it, no one notices it. <laughs> Obviously, if you're a makeup guru, you will notice that shit right off the bat. Because y'all some, y'all always be knowing what we doing wrong. And I saw a new trick that I could do. And I'm going to like use it in a second. It's like not really a trick. I feel like everyone uses it, but you know. Oh well. Now. We're going to try this again. This is my second time trying to do this method. I don't usually do this method. But it works somewhat. Because it makes my makeup stay. I'm going to use concealer. Tap that shit on. So that it's not really sticky. And then I'll use this color. It legit works. I love it. Makes your makeup stay on there. You see? Makes it pop against the other color. Because every time I didn't use this method, it didn't pop. Like, it was annoying. It just blended in with the makeup that I had already put down. So... I don't like it. But this right here, I like. I try not to talk too much when I do this because I usually mess up when I talk. So I'm sorry if I'm silent. I will fix the harsh line. I'm not going to let it leave it there, okay, y'all? I'm not gonna leave it like that. There's a reason why I let it. I did a short line in the first place. See, now I want it. So now, I'm gonna fix the short line with this brush. Is this a fluffy but Oh, that didn't work. Come on. We're all fix it with this brush. There you go. That's better. Okay. 
This one looks too sharp now, does it? Okay, okay, okay girl. Okay, now we're going to use this real dark blue right here. We're going to use this real dark blue, this one. Just because I'm curious on what it would look like at the end of everything. So, actually, I'm going to do the concealer trick again. So that the dark actually comes out. Now to fix that sharpness, I'm going to do this. I'm blending it out because I don't want it to. Oh, that's pretty. I did good. It's not pretty, y'all. Ooh, that's cute. I'm, I'm sorry, y'all. I ain't never did anything this good. I always wipe it off on my hand because I don't have anything else to wipe it on. And I ain't wiping it out of my bed. Uh-uh. You ain't gonna do that shit not today. Not on my bed. Not on my bed. Anyways, I'm probably gonna put more of this on because I'm pretty sure this one dried up on me. Anyways. I said I'd be there at 4.30. Not what happened now because I still got to go to Target. So, um, they just know I'm going to be late. Oh, shit. <laughs> then I even had that on my hand. Okay. Now, what color did I use before? I did this color. I'm pretty sure I used that color, right? Yeah, I used that color. I think. Yeah, yeah, I used that color thing. Shit, no, I didn't. Oh no, I used the wrong color. <gasps> <laughs> my problems right now. Perfectly, because I think I used the wrong color on my skin. That's so I did. It was this color. I used this color. Oh my god. Now it's two different fucking colors. Oh my god. <laughs> This is horrible. Anyways, I'm just gonna go for it. These brushes low key are, well, I like the filling of them, so I mean, they hurt my eyeballs, but that's because I press really hard. Sorry, I was looking at my other phone. Because, as y'all don't know already, I film on this one. This is not technically my everyday makeup. I mean, my everyday makeup is whatever color I'm wearing that day. If I'm wearing gray, it's gonna be a smoky eye black. Or gray. Like, I use gray. There's gray in this um, palette. Actually, there's like four different colors of gray. What is in my eyeball? Okay. Literally, what is in my eyeball? Yo, I have a problem. <laughs> okay. I legit have a problem. I have a problem. Anyways, now I used that color and then I ended up using that color. So now we're going to use the primer. I mean, like, the concealer again. I can't even talk today. It's so sad.
now we're going to use this color. The dark color that I have on here. This color again. I like very pigmented stuff, so. I'm gonna go to Ulta today. I know they be selling their makeup. I don't give a fuck. <laughs> I'm pretty sure everyone else does too. They just haven't got caught yet. The only thing I won't use that's reusable is like the eyes. Like eye stuff, eyeshadow. Um, you know, the obvious stuff that you don't want to use on your face that somebody else used. Try not to make this obvious. Okay, now I'm going to use more concealer because it's working and I like it. Oh shit, let me do that. By the way, if you ever fuck up on your eyeliner, you can just use foundation and just like swipe it up and it will look like you never fucked it up. Cause I did that once and it works. So now we're just gonna use this color right here, that one. And yes, I'm going to fix the other one too because it's not as vibrant as this one was. Y'all be losing all my brushes all the time. I don't know. So that's what it looks like. Beautiful. Now, I'm gonna put this back in the little palette because I have a dog and my dog may eat it if I leave it out. So, put this back on in here. Put it right back in. <laughs> right back in. Yeah. Now, eyeliner. The hardest part in the world, I swear. So I'm actually gonna do this first, cause last time I didn't do it, my eyebrows, my eyelashes were looking mad ugly. And I'm just making sure it's even, y'all. Like, making sure that my things look like they have enough eyeshadow on, because sometimes if you don't check it, then it looks kind of uneven. I just like. Put something in my eyeball. My eyeball. Okay. This is new eyeliner that I just bought. And it's so hard to use. I'm so mad that I bought the same. But it was only $2. So. Now, I want to try to do a really small line. So, I always start a line first. And then I go down. And then I shade it in, shade it in, color it in like a coloring book. So I'm finished with this one. Dude, I have like fallout right there, but I'm not gonna fix it. Alright, so what? So what? Alright. 
I messed this one up. I always mess this one up. Oh well. It's gonna look different. Look, that one's up and that one's not up. And I don't have foundation to fix it. So either I'm gonna continue to fuck it up or I'm gonna fuck it up anymore. Either way it's gonna be fucked up. Darn it, I didn't want to mess that up. Oh well. Cause that one's cute, this one's not. Whatever, 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 whatever. Almost done, almost done, almost done. Now, last thing but not least, I don't wear lipstick like that because I don't have lipstick to match this. So, we're not going to use any. Like, I have lip colors, but I don't use them because they don't look good on me. I can't find a shade of lipstick that actually looks good on me. So, actually, I do have one, but it doesn't match this. And I don't do my eye, but my bottom eyelashes, cause just no. So, yes, I'm done, guys. I'm so done. So, this is a look that I am done with. Yes, there's a little bit of fallout, but who cares? Uh, thank you for watching. Bye.